and then the but, plank? But no, 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 no spiders. Okay, all right. Boston's going to do the plank on the VR headset. How many days have we been here? <laughs> Two? Three. This is the third day. The, in years past, <laughs> we stayed like, how, what's the max days we've stayed in a row? Oh, yeah, I think we stayed like a solid week one time and we like went outside and we were like, oh, it's bright out here. <laughs> so, so leaving on the morning of the third day, I mean, I think we've improved. <laughs> Wait, so you're saying less days? Is well, in our, yes. in our, like, laying in our filth, <laughs> we've improved on the our number of days. <laughs> and our desire to shower has increased. That's, that's good. Our dog is going to go home depressed. It won't have a friend. It won't. <laughs> our dogs played so good together. Oh, they were in heaven. Each of my kids had, like, endless amounts of fun. And yet, somehow they're still complaining. Because I love uh, that's, that's a little brutal for me when the kids are like, what, it's time to go home? And like give me this like sad sack look. I'm like, you just played for, since Christmas, you've been playing. And they can find things to complain about. It just makes me a little crazy, but it's fine. In all fairness. Fine. Yes. In all fairness, I kind of feel the same way. I'm like, oh, I, I have to go. Okay, Why? that that's actually oh, very true. Like, What's happening? Okay. Just one more day, mom and dad, Can please. Go to your house now. Yeah, your yeah yeah yeah. <laughs> Let's go to your house now. No. Our house is not fun. Yes, it is. <laughs> okay, we'll bring the VR headset. Okay. Olivia, what are you doing? <laughs> Can you make it not have spiders? No, yeah. no, it's just a spider ring. It has like. He's walking out yeah. on a plank right now. <laughs> Do not, Olivia, no. no I don't, there's gonna be spiders. There's, no, there's I not. promise you there will not be spiders. Cody and Boston. Or Boston Cody and Olivia. There. Do not push him. Leave him alone. Did you eat all of them in one bite? Yeah. That's amazing. Oh, Are you? Does it feel weird, Boston? Oh, He's at the very end. Bye. I'm falling. Oh my Are gosh, he walked off of it. It's not even. He's not even scared. Oh, and P.S. Uncle Jared and Aunt Ellie convinced Lincoln that he loves man buns. Do you like your man bun? What he Lincoln? said yes. I, I, you did? Yeah, he said yes. yes. Mom. Today is a sad day because we are going to be taking down Christmas. We are going to put the Christmas tree away. We are going to put the reindeer away. We're going to put the mantly fluffy things away and the wreaths away and the nativity set away and the picture of Santa away. The feeling of the house is going to change today and there's one last thing that has to go. The last thing that has to change is all of this sugar. So I didn't mind having it for the holidays but now that the holiday is over this can't be in the house. And the thing that I was thinking is like, oh, maybe I'll just put it down like in the cold room so we don't have it. But if I know it's down there, I might sneak it. If it's not in the house, I don't eat it. So what do I do? Do I just toss it? No. I know. I hate being wasteful, but I also can't have this in the house. No. Or I'll eat it. I'll eat it. You know. Or the kids will eat it. And none of us need it. This plethora of snow clothes on the ground is ready for ski day with Cody, Boston, and Olivia. and Olivia, who is getting her braids done as we speak. Lincoln is not quite big enough to go skiing just yet. I need to take him by himself and teach him before we go, and I kind of want to take the kids to a big resort today. So in order to do that, I don't want to take Lincoln with me and spend the day away from the big kids. I want the big kids to go. Oh yeah. Yeah, they do have some big, just, some I big hills. I love yeah. the kitty hill. Okay, we'll do plenty. Dad will be with me a lot. Yeah, we'll be with you a lot. You gotta be tough though, okay? Okay. You gonna like be tough? I like the jumps on the kitty. Yeah. Me too. Okay. But I don't like to be high, cause... Well, right. can't go skiing if you're not gonna get high, cause you gotta go up the mountain. I was having a moment of weakness, but it's going in the garbage. So here's a tip for anyone that's wanting to throw all of um, their Christmas junk food away. Don't do it in front of your toddler. That was a bad idea. 
I can hear him in the other room crying. And if I'm being honest, it's, it feels painful to do this. It truly feels painful to do this, but it's necessary. Remember those days, those L's, I could sleep right now. I get paid, fake games, stay in peace. I'm breaking the blues over steak, I gotta eat right. You could be my peace, sign. I don't need that energy around me. The roads are so bad. I have not been through this canyon this bad for years now. We're down to like 25, 35 miles an hour when it's 60 usually because of how bad the roads are. Holy cannoli. What? Look at this weather. This is so nice, guys. This is, this is beautiful ski weather right now. The snow and the roads coming up were a little bit... A little bit grim, but not too bad. I mean, it wasn't like a blackout, but it was slippery. Four wheel drive, we were just fine. And now, you guys are gonna be making some fresh tracks today. That's fun. How many calories, calories do you think you could burn? Do you know what? On a normal ski day, you probably burn five or 600 calories or more. But where you've got so much fresh powder up there, you're gonna burn twice that. It's gonna be a lot more work yeah, skiing. What times, times what? So, I've, 600 times two. Times two. Six times two. It'd be twelve thousand. Twelve hundred. One thousand twelve hundred. Or two hundred. That's a lot of I was that's close. a lot of calories. I mean I was kinda close. So in one hour you guys are gonna burn off that corn dog real quick. Well after what took at least an hour to get all of our skis and boots all set up, Cody and Olivia are on the lift in front of us and Boston and I are right here. Um you excited, bud? Mm -hmm. Is your head warm? Mm -hmm. It looks like it's warm. Mm -hmm. My head's warm. I think I made the grave mistake of uh, forgetting goggles for everybody. Yeah. Normally it wouldn't be a big deal, but on snowy days like this, it kind of pelts your eyes a little bit, but we'll just take things nice and slow. Look at these fresh tracks, bud. We could come down here and sit some nice fresh powder tracks. Why are they walking up? Because they lost their skis. That, my friend, is what we call a yard sale when you biff it on a jump and you lose everything. You want to burn some calories? That's it, right there. Olivia, you got to turn on that outside foot, okay? You got to turn it. You'll just keep picking up speed if you don't turn. Okay, spin yourself around so your skis are downhill. Now you can stand up, there you go. Turn with the outside foot. You want to go this way, so lean on that right foot. If you lean on your right foot, you'll turn to the left. Yep, exactly. And we want to go this way. Just slow it down. Little snow plow, yeah, nice and easy. See how good. Yeah, you can, Olivia. You've been skiing for three years. You can do it. It's gonna feel a little uncomfortable for a minute, but you'll get used to it again. Nice, easy turn. Okay, Boston Wado, Cody, let's go. Follow Olivia. Olivia and Cody are already heading down the hill by themselves. I knew the second she got comfortable on the hill. She'd be just fine. Or the second that I gave her permission to go by herself, she'd be like, oh, I'm all of a sudden a good skier. It's reverse psychology. She thinks she thought of it, but I thought of it. In my head, I knew. Cody, you gotta get up or you're gonna miss it. You didn't make it, bud. Hey, those are good turns, bud. Olivia, most improved for the day. Good yeah. turns. Oh, you think you're just such a big girl, but dad still has to get you dressed. My 10 year old little baby. Thanks for not listening to Boston, sticking together. To heck with the first rule. You guys just broke it. You didn't even bend it. You just broke the first rule. Me and Cody stuck oh, you, together. Sure you didn't. Whatever. Beautiful day for skiing. Wonderful. Good job, guys. Oh, Boston Wado. Look at that clean bum. That means you haven't fallen once, bud. Good job, Dolly. 
look like an alpine bunny. I do have a confession. When I got up here, I was a little bit stressed out. I was excited to take the kids skiing, but I was very stressed out. And then when the kids kind of got away from each other and they were like fearful of their own talents that they've actually learned of skiing um, and they were doubting themselves. So I was a little frustrated because I was just like, oh, come on, I can't. Oh, it's a lot of exhausting energy to just keep you guys moving and going. But honestly, we just finished one of the best runs and longest runs I think these kids have ever been on. That's a long run and they did great. You didn't I fall once, you fell once, you fell a couple times, but you guys were trying different things. Daddy, so I, you guys I've did good. I fell this whole entire time. You haven't and I'm really proud of you, bud. I mean, you're skiing like a little baby, but you're doing great. I'm really proud of you guys. And I just had to like Ooh. verbally say that because in my mind I thought there's no need for me to get stressed out about this. There's, I just need to relax. It is what it is and enjoy it. And chances are it'll be better than I thought. And it was. So thanks guys. We'll keep skiing more. Well, the Christmas decorations are down and put away and the storage room is more organized than before for sure <laughs> um the kids are all home from their ski day you guys look exhausted kids don't worry i am heating up the water pot so we can have we are going to have hot chocolate i'm making you english scones and cut up bananas that's what we're going to do for dinner because it's kind of warm kind of filling does that sound okay but basically, but I have a whole grocery list, so. Don't dumb down the English muffins, Lincoln. More than toast. Guys, so tomorrow, after I go grocery shopping, we'll have a full fridge, okay? There's just not a whole lot in here. I'll keep this bottle. Um, and this is I have two pairs of pajamas, a pair of socks, and two blankets. No. And one of my best friend. Yes, that is not weird at all. It's not weird at all. Okay, we're gonna close the vlog here so I can get the kids fed, get the kids put to bed, and I'm probably gonna take a shower. So, if you enjoyed today's video, give the vlog a thumbs up, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, guys. Bye. Aw, bye. Remember those days, those L's, I could sleep right now. Get paid, fake games, stay in peace. I'm breaking the blues over steak, I gotta eat right. You could be my peace, I don't need that energy around me.